Well, I am so excited because I have a dog in hand, first of all. Dolly's <laughs> joining me. She might be the star, but I also have another star here, Dr. Adam Hedgeco. We are at North Royalton Animal Hospital. Yep. Thank you for having us oh, here, thank by you for the way. Today. You know what? This is the time of year. Tis the season for holidays. But we got to make sure we keep these little guys safe around the holidays. And you're the Absolutely. perfect person to talk with safety tips about all that. Yes. You know, this time of the year, we love to celebrate time with our family, and we also love celebrating time with our pets. And we want to make sure that they have a great time and are safe, and there's some simple tips that we can follow during the holiday to make sure that happens. I think you need to mention these because even I forget, I mean, everyone forgets at times. You've got a lot going on. There's Absolutely. a lot to think about. So yep. what would be some of those so good there's, tips? There's three main categories. One is food. There's some foods out there that we tend to uh, enjoy and indulge in that aren't always safe for our pets. So remembering the fatty foods like uh, greasy foods and gravies and turkey uh, skins can be really toxic to pets and cause diseases like pancreatitis, which sometimes they need to be hospitalized for. And then you have chocolates and, uh, and grapes and raisins and onions that can also be toxic to pets. When you think about Christmas decorations, there's all kinds of things that oh, pets can yes. get into, right? Mm -hmm. They can be really mischievous, bright lights and flashing things can be really enticing for pets to explore, but they can be dangerous if they start to chew on Christmas lights when they're plugged in or the glittery tinsel on a tree. Ah. Cat favorites, which sometimes get stuck in their intestines and then they come here and we have to do surgery on them. So keeping those things away from pets is a great idea. And something that people forget about if you have a live tree is tree water. They go They'll underneath drink the, the tree. Water. Yep. So when you're thinking about decorating your tree, make sure that you're keeping pets away. Some dogs will, you know, big dogs can knock over those trees. So make sure they're anchored really well. What can the tree water do to them? It'll cause GI upset. So vomiting, diarrhea, loss of appetite. They can feel really lousy from it sometimes. And so clearly you do. You see some of the worst scenarios, but you also see some of the in-between. So when it comes to what all you do here, the services that you offer, it's clearly a wide array. It is. We see dogs and cats here, and we have seven doctors that, are, that work here, and our passion is helping pets and their families. We do a lot of community service. We have a pet carnival in the summer, uh, and we just like to celebrate the relationship that we have with our pets and make sure that we're doing everything we can to keep pets healthy so families can enjoy those relationships. So you're talking everything. Do you do the routine dental things? We do surgeries here. So mm -hmm. we'll do dentals, we'll do soft tissue surgeries and abdominal surgeries, and then we do routine preventative care and we see sick pets as well. And what I'm really excited about is that you and your wonderful office here have decided to help us celebrate Christmas with our animals and sponsoring our amazing ugly sweater contest, which to be honest, we know that anything these guys put on is going to be cute no matter Absolutely. what it is. Yep, and I, we are so excited to be part of that. Uh, you know, pets are such a big part of our family and anything we can do to celebrate those relationships and, and have fun during the holiday season is what we're all about. Well, I think we need to put a really cute, ugly sweater on you. What do you think, Dolly? What do you think about that, huh? Can we, can, she may not be able to win, but we'll I think we one. need to include her Absolutely. in this. Absolutely. What do you think, Dolly? Yeah? <laughs> this also happens to be his animal, too. So that's why she's looking at like, Dad, I'll take you back. All right, you know what? We're going to send her off to you. Come and I'm going to say, Dolly. can't wait for all of you to send in your adorable pet costume pictures. Right, Dolly? Right. <laughs>